Hey guys, Joe here with FlexArm uh, doing a tap test today on, a, on an interesting part. Uh, we're working with some plastic. Um, it's for a, uh, a drip tray for an air conditioner. Uh, we're working with Scott Norton from Zoair. He's one of the distributors that we work with. And uh, his customer basically has an interesting application where they're using a, a three quarter inch NPT tap. It's a big guy. Um, but we're basically looking to, to go into plastic so we don't need a ton of torque to get the job done. Um, the issue that we ran into initially was that the size of the tap is almost dictating the machine that we had to work with and we're gonna have to go to a size 3 chuck. That's a big sucker right there. So basically what happened was our CNC manager Steve uh, saw me out here working on it and came over and said hold on a second let me make you a custom tap holder so we can put it into our A32. Uh, so you'll be able to see that uh, we were able to accomplish it with one of our smaller units 400 rpm motor um, Works well, uh, auto depth stop on there, make sure that we get down to the bottom of the hole, um, not having any issues with it. So um, tap test went well. Uh, we successfully tapped six different parts. Um, and then you'll see in the video, we did a kind of a rapid succession uh, to show how you'd be able to do it in production. Um, I do know that these parts are a little bit bigger, so they're about four feet long. Uh, so the only other thing that I would suggest, it works great on the A32, uh, but because it's a pneumatic motor, can't really control the speed that well. Uh, one of the parts I did end up stripping out at one point. One of the suggestions that I, I am going to make to the client uh, is that we go with one of our hydraulic units. The issue with the A32 uh, going into plastic, um, it's got plenty of torque to get to the bottom of the hole, but almost too much. And so with the GH18, we can actually dial in the RPM uh, to make sure we're not ripping through the plastic. Uh, I did strip out one part um, going through the process. Uh, so definitely looking at the GH18, uh, with an auto depth stop, it'll be the perfect fit for this application. Thank you.